In this video, we're going to talk about how to convert PPM, that is parts per million, to PPB, parts per billion. These are different units of concentration. They're designed to represent substances with very, very low concentration values. So let's say we have a solution that has a concentration of sodium chloride, that's 0.35 ppm. How would you convert this to ppb? Well, it's important to know that one ppb, actually one ppm rather, is equal to a thousand parts per billion. A billion is 10 to the nine and a million is 10 to the six. So these two numbers, they differ by a thousand. And so it turns out that one part per million is a thousand parts per billion. It's kind of inverted, but one is a thousand times greater than the other. So with that conversion factor, we can convert from PPM to PPB. So we can say that one PPM is equal to a thousand PPB. And thus these two units will cancel. So it's going to be 0.35 times a thousand, which is 350 parts per billion. So let's work on another example. For the sake of practice, go ahead and convert 0.07 ppm to ppb. Feel free to pause the video if you want to try it. So we just got to follow the same pattern. We're going to multiply it by 1,000 ppb per 1 ppm. So 0 0.07 times 1,000, you simply need to move the decimal point three units to the right. And this is going to give you 70 parts per billion. So now you know how to convert from parts per million to parts per billion. Now let's work backwards. So let's say we have a solution that is 160 parts per billion. What is that concentration equal to in parts per million? Go ahead and work on that. So we're going to start with what we're given, 160 parts per billion over 1. And we're going to use this conversion factor. So what should we put on top and what should we put on the bottom? This number, should it go on the top or on the bottom, what would you say? Now we want the units PPB to cancel. So we want PPB to be on the bottom. Thus we're going to put this part on the bottom. This is going to go on top. So when converting from one unit to another unit, you want to set up the fractions in such a way that these units will cancel. And then you get the desired unit that you want, which is PPM. So it's 160 divided by 1,000. So this time, we're moving the decimal point three units to the left. So it's going to be 0.16 ppm. And so that's how you can convert from PPB to PPM. So let's summarize what we've just considered here. If we want to go from PPM to parts per billion, we need to multiply by a thousand. If we wish to go backwards, that is from parts per billion to parts per million, then we need to divide by a thousand. So just to give you some values, so we said that one part per million is a thousand parts per billion. 0.5 parts per million is 500 parts per billion. 0 0.08 parts per million is 80 parts per billion. So notice that the number in front of parts per billion is always bigger than a number in front of parts per million. It's always a thousand times more. So now you know how to convert between parts per million and parts per billion. So that's basically it for this video. Hopefully it gave you a, a good idea of how to interconvert between these two units. 
Thanks for watching.